You know what, you guys? Good morning. Good afternoon. I'm back with another video. Um, And you know what's really weird, you guys? I can see, you know, why people are so mistrusting of this government and the, and the lies that they tell or the, the half-truths that they tell. Um, you know, in my state, Wisconsin, they're trying to purge 200-something thousand um, voters from the registrar, right? So, I filled out for absentee voting, I don't know, maybe about a month ago or so, and my ballot hasn't gotten here yet. And Tuesday is the day to vote, right? That's number one. Okay, but they do have these drop boxes. So, say if it did show up today or Monday... I could still drop it in the box on Tuesday, right? Because I, that would be too close for me to stick it in the mail. It's obvious. Now, here's the crazy part. Because Tony Evers, the damn governor, allowed these, these Republicans in the, in the high court to say that the voting should still take place on Tuesday. Now, you got the damn coronavirus running rampant, and they saying people shouldn't be within six feet of one another. Yet and still, we're going to try to hold an election. Because somebody tell me what the hell is really going on. What type of... What type of Sam's hell craziness is this? I'm just trying to keep it clean and... What kind of obvious fraud craziness is this? Wisconsin, the county of Milwaukee that uh, usually has like 164 uh, uh, poll sites. And they're going to narrow it down to 12. <laughs> but yet everybody can go vote. This is some insane crock of Mamie crap. This is voter suppression. This is how you stop this is how you do crazy stuff. This is how you keep that dude in office and allow the powers that be that's running him to continue to run him up in a society and drain this place dry. Because it stopped being a country a long time ago. I keep telling you, once you understand when we can go and look on the New York Stock Exchange or in Delaware and stuff and see the United States listed as a corporation, then that means some things have changed drastically. <laughs> and we keep yelling about the Constitution, the Constitution, but you got people screwing over the Constitution, laughing at the Constitution, doing whatever they want to do, just running amok. And then we sitting here like nothing can't be done. Like, oh, the president did. Oh, the president did. Oh, the president did. It's like, what? What the people do? What the people do? <laughs> Listen, I'm done. I'm done. They are going to have an election Tuesday. And they expect people to go out and vote locally. Because Lena Taylor is running against Tom Barrett. And everybody and their grandmama want Tom Barrett out in the black community at least. Because at this point, and Tom Barrett is a nice guy. You know, but he's just totally inept and he's ineffective. And as Milwaukee becomes a predominantly black city, the, the leadership has to reflect that. It has to reflect that, and I just think at this point, Lena Taylor, you can't go, you can't be, in, you can't get any worse. People are worried about her, and she's never. This is a senator, state senator, and I think she's do, a, she'll do a fine job as a mayor. I think she'll do a fine job as a mayor, and if people would vote um, from logic, and as and not from their color and their fear, um, because. Those are the only two forces that operate. Remember, love, fear. Love, fear. And if you operate out of fear, then, of course, we'll have Tom Barrett sitting there again. 
But at the end of the day, there's some things that need to be shook up in Milwaukee. But they definitely don't need to be shook up on Tuesday, April 7th, because a better way for all of us to have voted would have been absentee ballot. However, just the very fact, you know, that I haven't even gotten my ballot yet. <sighs> anyway. Y'all get the game. They play it all the time. So, um, it's not very encouraging. But anyway, with that being said, um, I thought I'd give you a heads up and let you know just how crazy these people are to think that we should be going out on Tuesday to go vote in the midst of a coronavirus that's killing everybody with only 12 voting uh, uh, municipalities open when it used to be 164. Just totally insane. All right. Well, tell me what you think about that. And what's going on in your state if you have if y'all haven't voted already? Uh are you voting Tuesday? Have or have the governor shut down and suspended it too further or made different arrangements or got you all voting um you know absentee? What's going on? Cause the madness here is just insane. And like I said, they said they were looking to purge two hundred thousand people from the purge from the rolls. I see how they're going to do it. I see. All right, you guys. I'm going to go. Like what you hear. Like, subscribe, and share. And I'll see you in the next video.